Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Who are you? I am that tiny seed that has come to make sure the bird is put to shame. I am that seed that has refused to germinate on fertile soil. I am the famished flamingo that has refused to feed on worms. What do you want from me? I have come to make sure that you do the dance of shame. With the stripes of your blood on this famished grass. Ah! Hey! The famished flamingo that has refused to feed on worms. Me. I have never had such a scary dream before. Hey, is it? I thought you have gone to the farm already. No, so no. Okay. Ola, please don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. For my sake. Don't. Don't come close to me. Don't. Tell me why. Tell me why at my age I cannot find a man to love me. What is wrong? Look, there is nothing wrong with you. I will talk to the girls about it. In fact, I will do something about it today. Please don't do it. For my sake, don't do it. You know, you're all I have. My eye. Oh, if you do it, the ghost will reject your spirit and they will throw you into the evil forest. Oh, I don't do it. Don't do it. Why? What I was did I do? Didn't Where did I go wrong? You didn't do anything. You didn't do anything. Gloria, <laughs> Gloria, what is going on? Alamba, are you alright? Hola. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oma, I don't know what is wrong with me. 
I saw myself doing it. Oh my, why has no man come for me? Why has no man come close to me? Why? Ola. You just have to stop thinking that you're not complete without a man. How would I stop thinking about it when no man has come close to me? You just have to. How? Oma. Oma, I need a man. Desperation is a terrible thing. And it leads to death. Ola. Ola. Hmm. You're still on this. I'm almost done. Okay. No. Oh. Welcome. Yeah. Did anyone go there to fetch water with a cooking pot? Nobody has been able to see what happened. Hey, this is strange. Strange? Very strange. One stream dried up in a rainy season. People say that she was angry because for seven months now no sacrifice has been made to her. And me, I believe so. Anyway, I'm going to go to fetch some water. You say that? Did I hear you say that? You're going to indulge to fetch water. Eh? Even people they are wicked and they hate us. I'm only going there to fetch water. And I know they are not going to send me back. Besides, I don't have any mark on my forehead to show that I'm from Amoli Mimi. Ekese. Ogini. Ekese. Eh? If you love your life, go back home. You and I know very well that Indolu people hate us very well. Have you ever heard that they killed anybody from his clan? So do not be the one I will hear about his death. Then nothing will happen to me. Go home, let me go and fetch okay, water. Go home. Let's come over If the gods reject my spirit, I will reject them. You're all I have. My eye. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. 
miracles will eject your spirit. I come in peace. What brings you to the clan that has a long anger in heart for your people? Mono suddenly dried up. I'm only here to fetch some water. And you will fall into the arms of the famished flamingo. I've never seen a flamingo before. I don't think there is one in Indiolo. I only hear it in folk tales. And you wouldn't want to see one, would you? Is it? What happened to you? Mother, I'm sorry. I will come back again. What are you talking about?
Went to warn you to fetch some water. Oh. oh no river does not let her own get drowned in her belly. No, what are you talking about? Oh. Eh? Talk to me. My daughter. Hmm? In my dream. I saw a case drowned in a river. Hey, Jimo. Uh, uh, May the gods forbid. Greetings, Ime. Greetings. How are you? I'm fine, Ime. I'm fine. Ime, did you see a case? A case? Yes. Is he not yet back from Ndiolo? Uh, did he go to Ndiolo? Uh, yes. He said, he said he was going to Ndiolo because Owen River dried up this morning. No! Uh, Why didn't you stop him? Why didn't you stop him? Hey! Jima! What is happening? Azadi! Sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Where is she going to now? <coughs> Sorry. Sorry. Three, four, five, six, seven. Seven kegs of palm wine from wood. When I have money, I will certainly pay you. Mazi, Mazi, I'm finished. Mwada, oh, is that you? It's me, Adadi. Uh, uh, Adadi, why are you screaming as if someone bitten by a snake? Please, you have to come with me. Ikeze is in trouble. Biko. What trouble? He went to Ndiolo to fetch water. Yes. And then my mother came around and said, she saw him drown in a river in her dream. Uh, yes. Does your mother have a river in her dream? Her dream always come to pass. Uh, yes. If AKZ has gone to Ndiol, it means he will not return. Mansi, uh? you cannot say such a thing about your late brother's only son. But your mother said it before me. Uh, let us talk on how to bury him. Uh, have you found his cops? <laughs> you scare me when you see things like this. Any man from Amole Mili who ventured into Ndiolo is considered a dead man. Hmm? Yes. What happened to her? Uh, uh, I saw her drowning in the river. Hola! Uh, Why are you doing this to yourself? Do, do you know her? Yes, she's uh, my friend. Please take me to her house. This way. Eh?
Thank you, my son. It's all right, Nne. What is your name? My name is Ekezi. The son of Obiazo. Ah. Oh. Thank you for saving my only daughter. You thank the gods. Nne, mm. I'll take my leave now. Send my address to you. I'll do that. What does he look like? He is so handsome. Tall, bold, and dark. Yes. Did you see his face? I saw a dark man before I became unconscious at the river. Yes, he is the one. I'm so glad that the gods have finally sent your heart drop after a long time of waiting. I'm so glad. Hmm. And you said you think he's from Amo Limeli? Yes, I followed him to Ama and he took the way to Ama Limeli. Why would the God send a man from Amo Limeli? He might be from Umeze. I just hope so. What are you doing here? How did you find this place? Oh. I was coming to say thank you for saving my life the other day. I did not save your life. The gods did. It's okay. I brought this for you. Go home with your hand. I know you appreciate what the gods did for you. Please, go home with it. I don't need it. That is why we have come. Yes. If you had told me we are going to come today, I would have informed my husband's people. Now they've all gone to Molo for a burial. Um, um, no problem, madam. No problem. Um, we will wait. Yes. Until we they come wait. back. Yes. Huh? Uh, where, where is Olama? Olama? Where are you coming from with the hen? Olama. It's all right. Mm -hmm. There's no problem. Excuse me. I'll be with you in a few minutes. I'm not at all. Okay. Mother, can you imagine? Ekeze returned my gift. He rejected it. You want to see him? Yes. Olamu, you should have allowed him to go with you. Mother, I am old enough to go to such places. <laughs> he was right. That boy is full of wisdom. And if I could walk a long distance, I would have gone with you to see him. Are the people of Amo Limili really wicked? Are they evil? 
Is he from Amo Nemele? Yes, but Ni, please don't tell my mother. Okay. Let's go to the kitchen and sit down. Oh, okay, Ni. This way, Ni. Mm. Why do we hate the people of Amoli Mili? Mm -mm. Her thread starts from the eyes and then the mouth and finally it lingers to the heart. I do not understand. I said her thread starts from the eyes and then the mouth and finally, it lingers to the heart. But that is not the case of Amo Limili and Ndiolo. In a sense, what you're saying in a sense is that. Hola, Ma. Come and greet our visitors. Nee, I am not coming out to greet them. I have told Okelwe that I do not wish to marry him. You know him? Yes. He does not have regards for women. Nee. Stop confusing this girl. The other day she wanted to take her life because she said men do not approach her. Now she's here rejecting the suitor. Ne is not confusing me. I don't like Okilwe. No. My daughter is sick. You have to go and come back later. It's like your daughter doesn't like my son. No. She has no choice. Anything I ask her to do, she does. I tell her what to do. Excuse me. We have to go and come back later. Okay, which means we are coming tomorrow. Let's check. Papa. What are you doing here? I have come to see you. To see me? Yes. I want to ask you a question. Do you hate me? That is not what you have in mind of asking. You want to ask why my people hate your people and why your people hate my people. I do not talk about hate. I do not hate. See? I want to talk about us. Do you hate me? I will not rescue you if my people see you here. Oh, I know this is Umoma. This is not Amo Lili. That's why I came to meet you. Go home. Go home. Why? Since the day you see me from the river, you have refused to set your eyes on me. What have I done to you? Wait. Go home! Who does he even think he is? You did what? You went to Ama Olimili? What is wrong with you? Oma, bring your voice down. What is wrong with you? You're shouting. Yes, I will shout. I will shout because I can't believe you, you, you could play with your life like this. What were you thinking? Just listen. 
I only went there to thank him for saving my life. And then, suddenly I, I started feeling something strong for him. Oma, he is a charming man. <gasps> Ola, he is from Amaoli Mili. And he is human. That is all I need right now. A real man. Why are you looking at me as if you've not seen me before? I, can I help you with the firewood? Did I tell you my neck is hurting? I didn't say so. I just wanted to help you. Go and help yourself. Why do you why do you hate me? I hate you because I do not like you. <laughs> I mean, what is funny? You are funny. <laughs> I know what you want, and let me tell you, you will never get it. It's okay. Give me the firewood. Let me help you. Oh. Take it from me, don't worry. Mm. I have to go before your father sees me. Thank you. For what? For forcing my firewood off my head. <laughs> What is it? What is it? Is this how you treat a woman who is fond of you? I am talking to you. Can't you see that I love you? Why are you shouting at me? Why? Why I'm shouting? Like you said, do you know how many men in my clan are asking for my hand in marriage? Yet you treat me like an outcast each time I come to you. I am going to Umweze. And this journey is too far. Hey, Casey. Hey, You behave so surreal. You must be possessed by one vile evil spirit. I am not possessed by any evil spirit. If you are not, then whatever that has possessed you is stronger than evil spirit. You are right. I am possessed. I am direly possessed by the love I have for you and it sears beyond my heart. Kiss me. I have never loved any man before. Please just listen to me. I love you and this love chokes me. Please. Flamingo. Famished Flamingo. I don't want to die. I know who you are. What, what did you call me? Famished Flamingo. Leave me alone!
Once, many years ago, I was in love with a man. Did he call you a flamingo? He called you that? Yes. Nee. What does a flamingo connote? Mm. They say it leads other animals into the heart of a lake where they meet their door. Um, nee. Can you now tell me why we are not in good terms with the people of Amoli? Few men from this club, which include your father, went for wrestling contest and they never returned. And they were killed by the people of Amoli Mili. They were never heard of and we waited for them to return. But they never did. And we assumed that they were killed by the people of Amolimili. Assumed? We let Assumption take peace away. Ekezie, mm. I prefer to die in Amolimili while trying to prove my love for you. It is love or death. My daughter, I have a baton. No, thank you. I don't want to. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me help you with this. <laughs> so who knows what you call me? Yes! <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> hey, Ma! You're back! <laughs> why you, why you, why you? Okay, say welcome. <laughs> hey! Put the walk in! Listen if to me. you continue to hurt me this way, I might just take my life. I am still talking. Listen to me. Stop this affection. It is not going to work. You did not just say that. Say it again. Because people are talking. They are talking about my venture into Ndiolo. Hmm. The 8th grade is going to invite you to caution you. Ike, talk something more important. So what I'm saying now is not important. Talk. Cha. It's not. Ike Z. From the way you are talking, it seems you've seen a beautiful woman in Indiolo. Because of that, you don't see any danger going to Indiolo. I will be waiting for you under the tree of blood when the sun graces the center of the sky. If you are late, you might just see my body dangling there. What? And I will have your name on my lips. Oh! 
Ola! Kom eens, Ola. Hé. Ola. Ik is het. Ola. Ik is het. Ik is het. Ik is het. Please, where is it your blood? Ah, uh, why are you running? I hope there is no problem. Please, where is it your blood? It's behind the armor. Where is the armor? Where is the armor? Close to the river. Okay. You are not wicked anyway. I... I thought I won't see you again. You love me then? I mean, why does it look odd when a woman goes after the man she loves? Why does it? Why do they think I, that... I love you, Mama. I love you. You do? shouldn't have done this. Did you just say that? I am the one who ought to be unhappy here. But I am not. So why are you so upset? What if you become pregnant? Then that settles it. I will become your wife. What is wrong with you? Why don't you think like others? Think like others. Think that we are enemies. Ikeze, I am not your enemy. Listen. I love you from my heart. Keep on thinking about you. I'll continue to love you. I will not hurt you. I break your heart. Oh, I'll keep on loving you. Okay. Can we see her tomorrow? tomorrow? Why? Because this place is not free for me. Oh, you don't have to bother. When you come tomorrow, we'll go to Moba together. It's okay. Let me start going. Hmm? Okay. Uh, send my regards to your mother. She will hear. Okay, I'm, I'm good. You're still standing.
This boy from Amolimili has been my rival. Hi! We shall see. Go on. my son to smile and laugh at the same time. Mother, nothing. Nothing? I see. I once felt like this when I was young. When you're ready to tell me. Do that. I almost fainted. Yeah, I'm sorry. Where are you going to? I'm just taking a walk. In that case, I can take a walk with you. Why will you walk with me? Are you my husband? Who knows? I can be one. How did I end up here today? Love. Love brought you here. Why must it be me? Don't you know. You are charming. <laughs> you know the right word to suit me with. <laughs> <laughs> what if you and I live here together? Forever. Are you seeing what I am thinking? I can take one to your father. Only if you say yes. We just started talking yesterday. And it's like ages. I can take care of you. Do you know, I actually came out to see if I could see you. <laughs> I did say it. I did say it. I love you. I love you too. It's very warm. It's very, very warm. I like that smile. <laughs> <laughs>
come tomorrow and prepare Orasu for you. How did you know that I love Orasu? I have seen you and your friend Ekeze plucking some Orasu. Someone has been watching me for a very long time now. The same way someone has been watching me for a very long time too. <laughs> ah, <laughs> Mad, you are your sweet mouth. When a woman is sweet, you call her sweet names. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Ike! Ike! Ure! 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 Ike! 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 Ike, what is it? He said you are sweet. How on earth did he know you are sweet? He was just praising me. And you were almost melting into his arms. Into his arms. Are you just jealous? Well, it is said when a man is jealous, he's truly in love. Oh, Green. I'm sorry. Oh. Not that I was angry. I, I, I don't like the way he was talking to you. His eyes was just becoming very, very calm as if okay. he, has, he, has, he has interest on you. It's okay. He was just praising me. Hmm? Praising you? It's okay. You don't that kind of praise. Okay, it's okay. You know you have to leave. I love you. I love you too, my lion. The ranging light in your eyes. The candid life in your voice. The love. The serene love. It leaves me hunger for the day you become my wife. Why has the gods chosen to bless me more than other maidens? I do not think it is because I am too beautiful. I know why. You do? Okay. We have an unfinished affection in our previous life, in our past world. Why do we think alike? Because 
we were one in our past life. We've been in love before we were born in this life. I hope this love goes with us to the afterlife. <laughs> yes, my queen. Oh. is a barrier. But why do you keep having this bad dream about a, a case here? Yeah. Mm. I, I dream about him always. Mm -hmm. Sweet dreams. This time, it, it moved from, from sweet to scary, full of nightmares, full of blood, yelling of pains, anguish, cries. Then, he might be thinking of you too. Wherever he is, it's all right. They had to speak. It's all right. It's all right. Are you worried? I'm worried about what your people will say and what my people will say. The hatred has been there before us. Need I remind you that I don't talk about it? Like you see, love can change it all. Where is the love taking us to? Then let us lead it to peace if it's leading nowhere. Why are you worried? I am worried about the dream. But you've not said anything about the dream. That is because you haven't asked. Okay. Was I killed by your people in the dream? No. You took me to a faraway land. We were made slaves. No, it cannot happen. Um, have you talked to your mother about us? There is no need to do so. What did you say? Are you trying to say this is leading nowhere? I haven't said so. Ikisi, listen to me. We can bring peace to your people and my people. How are we going to do that? Marry me. Better still, let us take an oath. Now I see you really want to put me into trouble. You might not see me again when next you come here.
Is he not yet back? I have not seen him. Where did he tell you he was going to? He didn't say where. He just ran off. Hey. What has come over Ikezi? Eh? Let it not be that he has gone to Ndolu again. No, he will come back. He will come back. I'll be back. I'm coming. Oh. Ne. Greetings. Greetings, Oma. Where is Oma? I don't. I don't know. I haven't seen her. But she said she was coming to your house. Oh yes. She came to my house early hours of this morning, but since then, we haven't seen. Where could she be? Eh? I have no idea. What happened to Okeze? I don't know. I saw him in the bush when I went to pick some herbs. Please, go to the best house and find out if Oma is there. We go. Okay, Nene. To her. It's like she ate poisonous leaves. Poisonous leaf? Yes. How could she eat poisonous leaf? I don't know. I don't know what has come over all of my Then what about the young man? He's alright. Say your father is Obiazo. Obiazo. Is he from this clan? I'm not from this clan. I'm from Amori. What? Yes. You? So it was you that pushed my daughter into the river the last time? No. I saw her drowning, then I saved her. Shut up. Shut up, you wicked boy from Amoli Mili. It was you that pushed my daughter into the river. What are you talking about? How can I possibly push a maiden that I do not know into the river? Now tell me, why did you want to take her life? No, I did not push her into the river. I, you stand before me and lie. You pushed her into the river. You wanted to kill her the same way your people killed her father. Now get out. From my house before I cast a spell on you. Get get out. I will not see myself as a man until I bring one man from India look down for killing a case. I was going to your house to remind you about my masquerade initiation. It's tonight. I will be expecting you. <laughs> 